Hi, friends and family. Pickable, I'm Lizzie here. Today is the last day of our four day, three nights Bangkok trip. I will enjoy the time to have fun and absorb bustling in Bangkok. <laughs> any plan to go to anywhere today so we just go to the places that suddenly pop up into our mind first we go to eat breakfast at chinatown and this is on pen chung the old your last fishball noodles i order clear soup plus noodles and chinese hot drinks mm, okay, yeah. The dish has many toppings like fried spring roll, fish ball, meat paste. The flat noodles have chewy texture. I really like it. I really like the soup because it's not too salty and it's really good seasoning. The Chinese heart truth is so refreshing and it's not too sweet which I really like. The dish is so good so I eat everything. After finish eating, we will visit Chinatown in the daytime. And my friend is buying Chinese little traditional dress for her niece. Chinatown in Bangkok is the paradise of street food even in the daytime. You can easily choose any type of food for breakfast, lunch and dinner here. We also visit inside the market in Chinatown. The people in the market selling many things like bag, shoes, clothes, earrings, and towel. And this is the shop that's selling Chinese traditional mooncake. Also, durian here is really good. Also, they have dry and fresh ingredients and fermented vegetables. While walking around Chinatown, we came across the temple, and we went inside to bow. We just stood in the yard to bow. There was a coffee near the temple, and we went there to chill and relax. The coffee named Blue Water. Coffee, tea, pink su, smoothie, and soda. You can order anything. And we order lychee pink su. It has milk, no cream, vanilla ice cream, lychee, jelly pearls, and dragon fruit. This is what I need for the hot day and it keeps us more energy. It's not too sweet but it has creamy texture and it's really refreshing. Mm -hmm. 
After eating ice cream, we decided to look for a deck of tarot cards, so we decided to go to the bookstore. Okay, now let's go to the mall. And this is M Quartier Complex. First, we need to look on the map where is the bookstore. And check it out, can you see anything there? There's Vietnamese restaurant. It's Le Dalek. We were lost for 15 minutes and now we just found the bookstore. It's Kino Kuniya Bookstore. We are looking for Tago Tart in bookstore. Thank you. And you guys, I cannot believe that they have very big area just for tarot decks. Best selling and new release decks. Oh my god. Can I shut her up? Thank you, Mui. Oh my god. Oh my god, see that ta Tarot, Tarot area Trời ơi, sao mà, sao mà Tarot á I was really amazed What? That's so much cool After finishing buying tarot desk, we went for lunch at Terminal 21 and it's just only one station away. And this is Cup Cow Cup La restaurant. We order so many dishes like fish fry, fried rice, tom yum, pad thai, raw shrimp salad, soft egg cooked with the sauce. Because this is our last meal in this trip, so we would like to have experience eating in the restaurant. In my personal opinion, the quality of the food here is good but not too special. My favorite dishes here are pad thai and soft eggs with the sauce. The price may be a bit high but in return you get a comfortable, clean, cool space and service by professional staffs. I'm nervous. Thank you. Welcome. Okay, now we are on the way to the airport. 
it takes 45 minutes to one hour so we can take a nap. At the airport, we have after you and so many cool places here. You can come here and then buy duty free stuff. After check in, I have subway dinner and get ready to go on the plane. On this occasion, I would like to thanks to everyone in Thailand for welcoming, loving, and treating us so well. We will miss you and Thailand very much when we return to Vietnam. I hope to have the opportunity to return here soon. Please continue to love and accompany me on my next journeys. Once again, I would like to thanks to you guys. And that's all my video. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.